I do actually. You tried to go to another therapist, didn't you? You didn't like what they had to say, did you? Come crawling back to me. I have all of the answers. You know, once people know, they want to hear the truth, they come to me. The other therapist, they don't know what they're doing. My practices are a bit more. precise. Okay. All right. So I do not have you in my system, however. You're not an official patient yet, no? Okay. That's all right. I love a new one. Fresh material, you know what I mean? And you look like a challenge. Yes, you do. So did you fill out all of my new patient paperwork? It was on the website. PDF format. Good, 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 good. Okay. And your payment method is... Fantastic. I think we are ready to proceed. Now the first session is very, very important. Because I need to get to know you. Yes, I do. You are a stranger now. A random lump of meat sitting in my office right now. And I, the same to you, truly. Okay, yet you chose me and my diploma to analyze you and understand your mind. Soon, you will not be a random lump, but a radiant, complex maze of emotion, hopes, dreams, history and personality traits, qualms, Weaknesses, ego, desires, <laughs> carnal explanations for your seemingly innocuous habits. Ready to begin? Good. Okay. It is very important that you answer all of these truthfully 
of course. I have a strict, 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 strict privacy policy. Stricter than most of my colleagues. <laughs> They're cowards, not me. That's why I have the most interesting patients. Are you interesting? That's the, that's the first question. All right. We shall start with these. And then we shall move on. But I have a few questions. Please do not resist, resist them at all. All right, open your phone. Take it out, open it. Please list your last five texts. Who are they from? What do they say? Now I type in shorthand, so it's no use trying to read my fingers. I've had patients try. <laughs> All right, very good, that's five. Okay. Now, did you buy that phone because you wanted to? Mm -hmm. Who were the last three people to call you? Check for me. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. When was that? Very good. How do you feel about a chest? greatest accomplishment someone close to you has achieved. Yourself, of course, please. What kind of therapist do you think I am? All right. Fascinating. Why do you think Kermit the Frog doesn't wear any clothes? Why do you think that? All right. Okay. Interesting theory. cream shop. Cookies and cream has just run out. What do you replace it with? Bold. <laughs> Very bold. Hmm. How many times have you ridden a Ferris wheel? to broccoli or to bread. Mm -hmm. If you were in an elevator with two other people and you silently farted, when one person exits, the other person says, woo, thank goodness they're gone. Would you fess up? Would you fess to your crimes? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All right. All right. Can
can you feel when someone is staring at you? Can you feel it? Even if you, you can't see them, but you know. You can feel it. Alright, very good. Very good. Okay. Very well. I am now going to list 40 neutral traits. Alright. If one of them resonates with you, please raise your hand. If one of them really resonates with you, raise both. Right? Go with your gut. You do not have to think hard or modify your answer if you believe you've answered incorrectly. Because I will be able to tell and I will correct it on my own. Okay, the list is here. Go on, practice. One hand, two hands, no hand, and you're ready. Okay. Absent-minded, amusing, authoritarian, breezy, busy, casual, competitive, complex, cute, determined, dreamy, dry, Experimental, familiar, formal, glamorous, hypnotic, impressionable, intense, modern, moralistic, mystical, neutral, non-committal, Outspoken, predictable, private, questioning, reserved, restrained, sarcastic, smooth, soft, stylish, surprising, tough, unchanging, Uninhibited, unpredictable, whimsical. It's already 40. Very good. I'm going to tally those up. So I'm giving it each separate one as a different fraction number, code, color. Okay. I'm just going to plug that into this equation here. And by my calculations, me. What colour is this? This part. What colour? Good. Good. Alright. What colour is this?
what color is this? No idea. Tell me. Good. Alright. What color is this? And finally, what color is this? Alright. We can move on then. I want you to tell me on a scale of daily, all right, daily, frequently, sometimes, occasionally, rarely, almost never, and never. Do you have that? You have that, right? Daily, frequently, sometimes, occasionally. Rarely, almost never, and never. Okay? Three ends of the spectrum and our middle there. Okay? Using that scale, how often do you make your bed? Brush your teeth. Trip or stumble. Yell at strangers on the street. Smoothies. Roll dice. Roll some dice. Right. Click on an ad that is clearly targeting you. Go to reply to something and then forget. Go to reply to something, have the message all typed out, but delete it on purpose. Right. Take a picture of yourself. How often? Okay. Take a picture of someone else. Use baby talk. Gaga goo goo. Okay, alright. Change your opinion. Wear wigs. Will you wear wigs? Okay, alright. Look intently at your hands. How often? Okay. See the back of your head via a mirror. Purchase a card, i.e. a birthday card, at a store. Mentally imagine your entire life with a stranger. Okay. All right. Tell yourself you are incorrect for feeling an emotion. Mm -hmm. I see. Sleep with the door open. Remember that salad fingers exist. How often do you remember that? Oh, all right, all right. Contemplate your favorite.
type of noodle. Very good. All right, perfect. This has given me much, much to investigate. Oh yes, you are no longer a random meat lump in my office, no. No, indeed, you are you. And I understand you. Yes. It's time to analyze a bit. Um, I must analyze what I see. I see you, indeed. And you must come back. Oh, yes. You must come back more often. We have much to discuss. Ooh, I'm glad you made an appointment. All right. Now let's take a look at our calendar here. Our next appointment could be... Let's see here. Ah, oh, yes. I have next Tuesday, 3 a.m. Perfect. Good. I will mark you down for then. Pleasure to meet you. Oh, you are going to make a very intriguing subject for my papers. And I will finally win the prestigious Big Brain Award. And Dr. Natalie Poofman can move the day. Well, I hope you have a most satisfying rest of your day. I have a lot of work here to do now. Yes, you understand. And then I have to see about a custom seven-piece 